Right, we'll just do another bit of a video, so we get on. I always get a little bit anxious, you know. I've come quite a long way along the drove now. The beautiful valley's down there. Um, <clears throat> from the map, it does look like this route eventually comes near to Ashholt, but because you can't see anything, so there's a gate there, see? That could be where that path came back round. Could be. But we don't know, do we? We don't know. My theory is, <clears throat> if I was doing the Stout Lane one, I'd be going up through there now. Round Dowborough Wood. And, uh... Across a field or something. Yeah. So there are fields there. I'm just trying out Sony again. Yeah. This I do get I do like the excitement of exploring. Believe me I do, and I'm so pleased when I find the place. You know? See, there's another training off there, look. Another path. What we don't want to do is find we've walked past the church. So what we're going to do here for a minute, let's just go down here a minute and see if we can see anything else. That's why the drove is very important for me at the moment as my main road, if you like, that I know, my boundary. So, if we look down here now, we might see something. Never know, we might do. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, there's um, West Bagborough there. Oh, it's so confusing, isn't it? That's, is that Lydia's Hill? That's Lydia's Hill. So we'd be coming back down. I reckon it's going to be somewhere down here. Do you? Yeah. I think so. But I can't see it. So basically we need to keep back on the main track. But it could be that this is the track I should take to the church. I've got no idea. I've got no idea. A lot we'll of trouble on with that. Sony at the moment keeps swatch it, swapping about. So I, uh, I've put it on auto something or other, auto intelligence scene and see how long it'll last. Seems to be cutting out after a couple of minutes. Um, I don't know how often that's done that. It's never done it till today either because I'm out exploring, it's messing me up. I might just need to put another battery in there. So I'm recording what I can. I got a feeling there's something called Asphalt Green or something um, down there, which we can't see because I'm I'm keeping to the drove at the moment. I'm not going. I'm not leaving the drove, but I got a feeling that's Asphalt Green, and it is probably further than I thought. But what happens is when you first find a looking for somewhere it always seems to take a long time because what it is you're processing everything around you um, you know every tree every gate every hill um, you're processing so it is best and there's no one about no one about at all who knows anything those two joggers never knew anything said they knew the area but they didn't um, they'd never been to the church I don't think they even recognize the name of the village anyway they're of no use to me <laughs> I can't and another thing is once you've committed like I am now there's a, and you know it's a long way back you cannot stop and get scared and go back you have to keep going your aim is to find the church now what I remember about it how many 
could be right over there in that bloody hill over there, see? Do you know what I mean? It could be it could be there. And I might have to go across a field. I've got no idea. It could be much further than I think. So I'm, I'm keeping an eye out to see if I can see it. But I'm following the route. Because eventually this tr this track, I believe, ends at a, a road. So we can't give up. But as I said, it is, a, it is going up on the way back. But it is a shame I don't have a vehicle really because I got a worry about getting home. Yeah, you don't worry when you've got your vehicle. You get back to it. Yeah. Well, about if you get back at 10 o'clock at night, don't matter. There ain't no buses after a certain time. There ain't no trains. Lots of trains have already been delayed and cancelled today. I was just lucky that I got out here. And it's nice weather. It's light evenings. And when, once I find a church, I'll be so relieved. I got here, I've done it. Do you know what I mean? That's what I'll be saying to myself. You've done it, Sheila. You, per you kept going. And I said to myself, you, you, the only thing you're allowed is water and sweets until you get there to stop you getting indigestion. Now, it seems to be working all right, so I'm going to leave it on this mode Sony for recording so it hasn't switched when I had it on P it kept wanting to switch now those people haven't come back do you reckon they've deliberately gone another way I won't be surprised of course a long way back up girl I know and it could be that the church is just down there Got no idea. No idea at all. And I said to my I said earlier, I don't know if there's hills. At the moment it's great, I'm going down. And there's still a fence there. <laughs> right, I'm gonna turn off for a little bit and study the map. Over and out. Right everyone, I've just met a nice woman, the first person I'd met to ask, apart from the two joggers who knew nothing, I had gone too far along the drove. Um, so she reckons I could actually go back up through the valley um, on the way back, say coming back here this way, go, you know, when I get to the church there'll be some more signposts. So it's the first left up here I've got to take, and, that, and she said, you'll see the church. Um, I mean, she looked a bit worried when about walking up the valley. I said, no, it's all right. I am a walker. <sighs> it's right. It's what I'm saying about when you make... I wasn't making a diversion. I was actually on the drove, but I, got, I knew I'd gone too far. But there was no way of knowing where to turn off, you know? So here we are. We're going downhill for a bit now, folks. Well, I'm not coming back this way, by the way. I'll find another way, but it's gorgeous, isn't it? Let's take some photos as well. I just met, I, this woman was coming in her 4x4. I just flagged her down with my map. And um, she stopped and she was really helpful and friendly. And uh, I think they probably think us walkers are mad, you know, but... Uh, she said, I'll see the church. Like first, she said, turn first left. Is that good? Thank goodness for that. There's a barn down here. I would have come to civilization eventually, but she said, I can walk up the valley and go through a gate or something. But uh, she said, you'd have to come back on this road, then go through a gate. I'll work that out once I get to the church. The important thing is getting to the church. So I did, um, 
I was over energetic and did a bit too much along the drove because they were, like I said the Quantocks don't put many signs out um, and, and, and you don't always know the distances either so I'm back on Sony at the moment I've put it on a particular scene selection so that it doesn't play up um, so I'm going down this narrow Somerset lane um, I'm keen to put my hat and take my coat off have a drink of water and but at the moment I'm just absolutely keen on getting to the hill because uh, she said when I go up the valley I said yeah I'll recognize the hills to my left so you know that's sort of roughly where I'll be heading but she said take the first turn in left when I get down here and that'll take you to the church and there's a signpost by the way so yeah there's a signpost, my goodness. At last we got some signs. But these quaint little, quaint little roads, aren't they, what we live in in Somerset? Let's take some pictures. And there's a sign to our shot as well. Oh my God. I was getting a little bit anxious, I must admit, a minute ago, when the drove went on and on and on. But here we've got a sign. <sighs> Look. It's only three miles to Nether Snow. <laughs> Just go in a bit. That's it. Okay, Sheila. Take a picture of that track. Right, we're on the way to Ashholt now. Didn't, it can't be far. It hasn't given mileage, so I think we're actually there. She said, I'll see the church. She lives down there, so. I mean, she's a well off person, you could tell. She, but she was extremely friendly and, um, and, and smiled and was helpful. Obviously, she was. I was waving her down. You've got to be careful out in the countryside, but most women trust other women. Do you know what I mean? So, anyway, it doesn't matter that we extended our walk along the drove because it gave us a wide scope. You see, so we know now we don't need to walk that far. All we need to know now is that path to turn off. But we're going deep into the into this coom now. So yeah, I remember when I came here before and I drove and I parked near the church. And um yeah, there's no way I'm walking back up here. Oh my goodness! Though she did say I'd have to get back on that track, didn't she? But I got a feeling there was a footpath by the church. So I reckon that's what I'll do. There's a path there as well. I'm just going to carry on down here. Right, I'm going to turn off for a bit, give the things a rest. Turning off the video as well. We just